Hey everyone, this is Chad from Good Creative Tutorial. Today we're going to do a simple technique in Adobe Photoshop on creating a gradient silhouette. Uh, so the first step is go ahead and open up a photo that has some kind of distinctive uh, delineation between the background and the subject. So if you have one that um, you can cut out the background with the selection tool, if you don't have that, or you can find a photo like this, I'll link to the iStock photo link. Uh, that has a more simple background. Uh, you could use one that has a light background. Maybe it's not as distinct. You just need a different uh, level of light. So if you have a very light background and a dark subject that's uh, you know not a wide variation basically between the subject and the background. So go ahead and open up a photo like that. I'm going to press Control J or Command J on the Mac and go ahead and duplicate that background layer. So we'll work on a duplicated layer. Then you want to go to Image Adjustments threshold and basically what we want to do is we want to drag it until not too much until you have a complete silhouette like that we just want kind of a it's not exactly a silhouette but it's kind of a uh, you get the distinctive features of the person without going too far over or something like that all right then go ahead and hit OK Next, we want to add a new layer, so go ahead and create a new layer in the la bottom of the Layers palette. And uh, click and hold onto the Paint Bucket tool and you'll get the Gradient tool. Or you might have the Gradient tool already selected, just press G regardless. And choose some kind of color scheme up here. You can create a custom one or you can use one of these presets. I'll just use this preset here. And I'm just going to press Control minus or Command minus to zoom out. And we'll just want to click and drag down like so, and then change this layer blending mode to the top layer to lighten. All right, and I've seen this. I recently saw this in uh, like a band's uh, album music art, and also think an advertisement had it. Uh, so it's a simple technique, just creating a gradient uh, for a tonal range on a photo that has a distinctive uh, foreground compared to the background. So it's a simple, effective technique. A couple different. Um, tools we used here and you can actually see the difference there's the before and then the after for that look thanks